going offshore. Um, last night we gawk fished until 4 a.m. and we got a couple dozen, so we don't have to buy our bait. I don't think I've ever bought bait before. We always catch our own bait. Yeah. So that's pretty awesome that we can do that. So That we know how to do that. Yes, that we know how to do that, and we have the ability to do that with my own boat. But we're going to try to go catch some kings. Um, we only have like two hours to fish because Victor has to go to work, and he slept in because he fished till 4 a.m. But... Hopefully, we'll get on some kingfish, so stay tuned. Again, right there through the nose. Make sure your wire sits nice and straight because you got to remember if they're swimming, they got to be nice and streamlined. Let this one out. What will it be? What will it be? What do you guys think it's gonna be? Brooke, what do you think it's gonna be? I think it's gonna be a little king. I do too. Hey. There you go. There we go, in the head. Perfect. In the boat. Hey, we didn't get skunked. Came out here with the intention of catching kings and we caught one already. And these things hit it so fast, they almost always get that second hook in them. See where that treb is? Actually, he's only hooked by the treb right there. All right, first king in the boat. Nice little king. Number one. First fish of the day, haven't even been fishing that long. Gear. You want to put us in gear? You're on! Get him, babe! Oh, he's dipping. Your drag set good. Yes, I do. Oh, he's taking line, isn't he? Oh, we got a nice fish. No! Did it pull or did you get cut off? No. I think that was a nice king. No. That one was taking a lot of wine. Ah, oh, so sad. So sad. So sad. We just lost a nice one. It was ripping lot. that one kingfish that you saw. Um, I'm actually going to make it for dinner tonight. 
and most people shy away from kingfish and they think it tastes bad, they think it tastes super fishy, and honestly it's not that bad, it's actually pretty good, as long as you're eating it on like the first or second day and it's nice and fresh, and it hasn't been sitting in your freezer for months getting uh, freezer burnt, then it's actually really good. And normally we would smoke it, that's our favorite way to eat kingfish is make king smoke kingfish dip, but we only caught one. So it's not worth it to bring out the smoker and everything, and it's just a lot of work, so Brooke's gonna make it on the grill. Stay tuned for this week's episode of Catch and Cook with Brooke. <laughs> So there's my filleted kingfish. I cut it up into some nice small chunks. Time to get to cooking. All right, so I just finished filling my kingfish and I chopped it up into smaller pieces like this. And I'm gonna put it in a bag and I'm gonna marinate it in some Italian dressing. I'm gonna go wash the boat and then once I'm done, I'm gonna put them on the grill. So my fish has been marinating for about 30 minutes. And I have these cast iron skillets that I'm gonna use that you can buy at Bass Pro and we love cooking our fish on this. It's great for putting it on the grill and each person has their own individual little skillet and it cooks on there awesome. Um, you can use like those aluminum foil boats or you can make boats out of aluminum foil. That works too, but this is what we like doing. Okay, so I have my kingfish in my pans with a little bit of oil so that they don't stick. I'm gonna put a little bit more Italian dressing on them. And then I'm gonna put some Parmesan cheese on top. Super easy recipe and now they're ready for the grill. All right, time to check on the fish. So they've been on for about 10 minutes. They're getting brown on the bottom, so they're definitely finished, so I'm gonna bring them inside. They look good and they smell amazing. All right, here is the finished product. Looks good, smells amazing. Another cool thing about these pans is it keeps your fish warm basically the whole time you're eating it. I don't know about you guys, but I don't like cold fish, so that's awesome. And we got some rice and salad. All right, so it's all finished, it's time to eat. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoy. This is an easy recipe that you can try with any fish. Please like the video and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks.